hi guys simply natural here welcome back to my channel and today i'm going to share with you part two of my supplements haul i would have showed you guys part one a few videos back and i just wanted to share the actual natural stuff and that i use which are also supplements but more in a natural form so if you'd like to see that just keep watching this is something that i got from a herb shop in tunapuna i will leave the information below i think the place is called the herb shop there's a really sweet lady there that um she sells different mixes and tinctures for different things you can even have things customized to, to your needs and your health your health requirements you can have things customized and she will try her best to make something to fit your needs right so this one is a immune tincture plus and they are different things they just have a list of the different things that are in there stuff like astragalus mullein elderberry and flower they have cayenne echinacea red raspberry rose hip and so on so they have a lot of different um herbs in there and you take about 0.5 ml drops as needed it's a small small dropper it has the measurements on there so this area here is 0.5 so that's about what you would use per day i do not use this um every single day so i got this because I did not get back the um, the immune gummies when mine was out so I have been taking this one sometimes every other day and I also take a vitamin C shot that I made you guys would have seen that if you follow me on Instagram at simply natural underscore YouTube or at simply natural so this is my vitamin C mixture my vitamin c shot that i take daily hubby and i have been taking this since last year as well we started taking this i do have um a video on my vlog channel simply naturals will showing you how i make this and you can also get the link to where i got the ingredients the ingredients listing and the amount of ingredients to make it right so this one is almost out i have to make um very soon so in this case we take sometimes two on a regular we will take two teaspoons a day sometimes it is four teaspoons or two teaspoons twice daily or sometimes we take all four in one shot it just depends on how we are feeling physically we would increase the doses based on how we are feeling on a particular day right so i would have the video link for you guys to see how i make this and it's very good all natural ingredients so the next thing i also got from the herb shop this is something that i have been using recently well more so this year um because of different stuff with anxiety and sleeping and so on so i have been drinking chamomile tea guys would have seen me showing that in my grocery haul healthy grocery haul and I also use this as well as an addition to boost up the chamomile tea and it's an insomnia sleep aid also has in chamomile um, lavender st. John's wood hops and so on a few other herbs that um, the lady put together so that you can have a really nice tincture and I take I say up to two milliliters one hour before bedtime and up to five milliliters a day right so the same thing the dropper has the the marking on it so each dropper has a marking and you just pick it up you squeeze it pick it up and you drop the amount you want to use in your tea and this has been helping and it's not just for sleep it also has stuff to calm your nerves and so on right so the other liquid supplements that I've been taking from time to time well this one 
it's completely finished this was the first one I used for um, sleep and relaxation and this was just the valerian tincture um, and I use one milliliter to two to four ounces of liquid up to four times daily you could use this and this is for sleep and relaxation this really helped as well and then I started taking the I decided to try this one which was the insomnia sleep aid the other thing that I have been trying I think since last year or early this year I've been trying is this mood enhancer again from the same lady from the same hub shop and um, this one has different herbs in it tribulus saw palmetto suma donkwai maca and so on right and this one helps with your mood so if I realize that I'm feeling dumb or whatever I notice coming on to that time of the month when it's very close I usually yeah my hormones be acting up and like right after and that has started happening within the past few years um yeah within, within the past year or so i've noticed it so i started taking this i don't take it as often as i take the others um but yeah mostly around that time i will take it and i will add it to my smoothies so most of these drink can be added to smoothies or you can um, add it to your tea or you can drink it in water just by itself so this one I usually like to add it to smoothies right um, the immune one I usually take it with water and the valerian and the sleep aid these two I would usually take in my tea at night another natural thing I've been using is this spirulina powder um, <clears throat> I can't remember what exactly it is made of but I will be posting I will put the information in the video but this is a high chlorophyll substance and I use it when I'm making smoothies and so on um, I usually add this to my smoothies um, just to give it an extra boost even if I'm adding kale or you know something green I will still add some of this and when I don't have then I will just use this in my smoothie. So these are some of the more natural or herbal stuff that I have been using as supplements. Let me know what have you been using. Um, this has been very helpful. My vitamin C immune shot as well as the insomnia um, and valerian tincture to help with calmness um, anxiety and helping you with sleep and so on have you guys ever tried any of these or anything like it let me know in the comment section below um, and if you have any recommendations of something that's worked really well for you you can let me know as well all right thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye